Good morning. Welcome to Orlando. How about those uh, coaster rides last night, huh? I'm still a little dizzy, but I could have been the vodka. I'm not so sure, but I'm happy to be here this morning to introduce to you the ST3400H, now trademarked by Sandel, Helitaz. And I want to let you know that Helitaz is more than an h -taws. It is a search and rescue, EMS, and special missions device that can give uh, those guys a very precise and accurate view of the terrain and protect them and help them also fly those special missions in support. Some of the features of the SD3400H, or Helitas, as we've trademarked, is it supports both Class A and B functionality. We can help you from the smallest aircraft up through a Part 29 aircraft. The more inputs you give us, the more precise flight uh, data we're going to give you back. We do it all uh, for one price, and as I said, both Part 27 up through 29. And we've also found out that we are, we are going to do original STCs, and we're now told by our FAA folks that uh, follow-on field approvals will be approved. So that's uh, something new that uh, we have discovered. And we do all this, of course, in a small 3 ATI package, following suit with uh, the Sandell's uh, ability to go in locations that uh, other, place, other, other units and things cannot. We do a 3 ATI package, and it's all in that 3 ATI package. Of course, we will also take care of all those military special missions uh, personnel by doing Class B uh, INVIS, and that is on-demand INVIS, meaning that you're going to get full daylight capabilities and full night vision capabilities out of this product. One of the most significant features of the product is we use a three arc second terrain database, which is four times the resolution of the current HTOS products on the market today. Um, we will do obstacle depicting on the obstacle, not the grid, not the block, but actually the obstacle. You know, you'll be seeing a little bit more of that here momentarily. Um, the remote switching is everything from muting to night vision. It's all on, on, the, uh, on the remote switch option. We also can double as your terrain display for any active traffic avoidance system. We are in the final throes of certification with the FAA at this point in time, and we will have products shortly for your customers. So I'll tell you what, now take a test hop with me to California, and we'll see what this product can do. This is our test aircraft, the AS350B2. This is a, is a kind of an overview of how you would approach a hill or hill or mountain. This, this, uh, this video right here is approaching the hilltop. Imagine a dark night. Imagine a foggy day that you cannot see that hilltop. But right in front of you, in the radio altimeter position, because we are now replacing the radio altimeter with this display, you will see the ter terrain alerting. We very distinctly circle the closest point of impact. So as you can see, the yellow circle, this is a caution alert. There are at towers on top of this hilltop. You can also clearly see the radio, radio altimeter information in the right hand, lower right hand corner of the display. And again, all this is in the pilot's field of vision because we've selected the radio altimeter position to be the replacement item for that. This last flight is their special mission guys going right up a canyon. And you can see how we're over a lake. You can even see the dam in the far end of the lake there, our reservoir, where it gets dark, dark black that is much more below your aircraft altitude. You can only do this if you have three arc second data and be this precise and not get nuisance alerts, because the biggest thing to an HDAWS is you do not want nuisance alerting when you're trying to land like this off airport and pick up a patient or do some other type of re uh, rescue operation. You want to know the terrain, but you do not want nuisance alerts. And as you can see, we're not getting the nuisance alerts, we're only getting situational awareness. So 
So I'd like to invite you to come to Sandell's booth. It is booth number 228. We have also very, uh, very good profit-inducing uh, deals for you there at the booth that we can help you out with. Also, I want to invite you to look into your schedules. We have a training class on Saturday. It will actually be, I believe, on our gyro product that uh, many of you are much familiar with. So thank you very much.